Many of you have watched my Nikon D500 review. In fact, it's one of my most popular videos right now, which is a true testament to the relevance of a cropped sensor DSLR in a world that is increasingly embracing full-frame camera bodies. I wanted to follow up with the review and tell you about some of my experiences with this camera, and then tell you what I still have coming up featuring the D500. For one, I still love this camera as much as I did in the review. The announcement and the launch was a real soap opera. But once the D500 got itself into people's hands, the soap opera gave way to a phenomenal shooting experience. It truly is a fast running pro level camera in a DX package. One thing I mentioned in the review was reported battery life. Well, Nikon is swapping out the older ENEL15 batteries at no cost for D500 users. The battery that comes with the camera is the latest and greatest, but folks like me who shoot multiple cameras that use this battery and who have bought additional ones in the past can get a free upgrade to the latest and greatest. There's a firmware update out too, and I am definitely going to load it onto my camera and I'll share that process with you. I have used this camera a ton. <laughs> Even I took it as my only DSLR on my big summer vacation. I did have one and only one occasion so far where the camera locked up after a shot. I turned the camera off and back on, still nothing. So I pulled out the battery, put it back in, and I was shooting again. I'm sure I'm not the only one who this has happened to, and if it hasn't already been addressed in the latest firmware update, I'm sure that it will be soon. I've recently posted the body tour of the camera and an overview of the menus. Coming up, I will share you detailed menu walkthroughs, a video on the new autofocus fine tuning assistance capability, and plenty more. Stay tuned this month and even next month for all of that. So if you have been thinking about the D500, I will tell you, it's a great buy. If you have one, let me know in the comments if you agree.